Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I had a few requests about how to create fuel ball using fiber mesh in ZBrush. Actually, I have a video that already made a character with fiber mesh. I'm going to post the link in the description so you can look it up. There, I didn't talk, so I'm going to explain a few things over here. So let's go to project and select this lovely lady this is pretty cool uh, let's close floor and first thing first uh, what I need to do is to split a few areas where we'll, I will have the hair so we are in symmetry let's press ctrl shift And let's select this area. Let's go to solo mode. We can move to control shift and select lasso. Okay, great. Uh, I'm not going to go that perfect because I just want to show how you can make the full ball for uh, making them easier to control the fiber mesh easier. So, Ctrl W. Actually, let's close symmetry. Let's mask this one and Ctrl W. Ctrl Shift. And actually, I want the right one. So, let's hide this one. And now let's go and make this part. So let's hide this small one, Ctrl W. And then let's go and hide this part, Ctrl W, so on and so forth. I did make it way better on the video, on the link, so you can see there, but something like this, so we kinda, let's go, actually let's keep this, just let's unhide this one. Control W. Okay, great. Let's select all these uh, groups from here. Something like this. Or actually, let's hide this one and hide this one. And now let's uh, press Control and mask this all. Now we can go to uh, Fiber Mesh. And let's press upper oh sorry rebus and fiber and then let's select this hair obviously with more patience this hair will look way better but that's fine for me uh, we can go to modifier and play with a lot of settings the max in fibers let's keep them more intense and then I don't know the coverage and so on and so forth. I'm not going to waste my time on this area. I'm just going to press accept. And as you can see, uh, because we had polygroups, uh, the hair has different color. And then let's press B and G for groom. And then let's select groom hair ball. Now the most important thing that we must do before we start uh, playing around with green hairball, we need to go to brush and then let, uh, go to auto masking and bring this 0 to 100. So it will only affect, uh, if I select the green one, it will affect only the green one. So let's see. As you can see, I have done my first hairball. That's pretty cool. Now let's select the reddish one, brownish. And this is the second one. And then let's select this one, the third one. 
and so on and so forth. The same like a, a hair salon, I guess. Let's make it bigger. <laughs> Here we can create two of them, the same polygroup. Oops, let's see, and this one is the last one, I guess. That's perfect, almost. Obviously, if the polygroups are set uh, correctly, you will work more easily. So that's pretty important to do that. Um, now we can go to B and Gloom and play around with all of these. Usually, I think the best one was Groom Plankton. No, B Groom Hair Long. It is a while that I didn't work in Fiber Mesh because of uh, Ornac Tricks. And with this one, you can do whatever you want. With shift, we can smooth this out. We can go to brush. Ah, it's already selected. That's great. But this is the same polygroup, so that's the same my problem. And now we can bring this one. And I think you got the point. Obviously, uh, you can play with more groom like let's see um let's see what you can control the length of the let's shift oops well this looks great <laughs> okay thank you for watching i really hope you learned something and this video was helpful as I said, I'm going to link uh, the oldest video where I did that Indian hair. Thank you for watching. Take care.